Hey guys, so we have a broody hen that I'm separating just for a little while and this is the rooster and he is trying her and she is going right back at him. <laughs> that was funny. Um, we had to separate her for a little bit because she won't let any of the other hens nest um, and lay eggs. She's not laying eggs right now. She just wants to sit on the nest all day and it's not good for them to do that. So we have her just temporarily um, for a couple hours <laughs> and a little crate. But as you can see, she is standing her ground. She wants to go after this rooster. I guess he gave up. Oh. I think she won that stare down. And here's our other boy coming over to <laughs> let him know that he is in charge. They're so funny. They definitely have a pecking order, and as you can see, she's um, not as aggressive towards this one because she's this is her, the one that she's used to, the rooster that she's grown up with. Though our white silky is a little newer, so she is all right with this guy. This is Precioso. Hi, Precioso. Precious in Spanish. Oh, he just. Hi, Precioso. He's doing his mating dance. He's letting our white silky know. White silky's name is Yeti. Letting him know that this is his hens. We will let her back out in a little bit. They usually free range all day. Um, it's just that it's really difficult right now because the other ones need to get into their nest in boxes and she won't allow it. And sometimes we've even had situations where another hen uh, suffocated one of our favorite hens in one of the nest in boxes. So they, um, they have this natural instinct to lay and hatch and they will do it at any cost um, so definitely in this breed the cochins are very uh, they're just known to go broody all the time and it is definitely um, true they have even just even before spring started they tend to go broody a lot but we love them they're very gentle Amazing little creatures. Hope you all have a blessed, good Friday.